Hey there guys, this is Phone Tech and today I'm going to be making a video to show you how to root your Galaxy S4. So uh, this will work on all the quad-core versions, so basically every one except the i9-500. So make sure to check which one you have. So we'll work on all the US carriers for sure and the i9-505. So let's get started. Uh, this method is really easy. It will not install recovery for you right now, but it will root it and it is really un easy to unroot it. You don't even need a computer actually to unroot it. So right now I'm going to be showing you how to root it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into your settings. And you want to go to more. About device. And then you're going to go down to bill number. And you're going to keep tapping that until it says you're a developer. So once it's done you're going to go back. And you'll have developer options now. So we're going to open that up, and as you can see it's on, we're going to check USB debugging, and we're going to click OK. Okay, so now you're going to need to hook up your phone to your computer, and you need to use the Galaxy S4 cable only. That's what I've heard, okay? So I'm going to connect my phone, and I'll be showing you what's on the computer, and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so now I'm back at the computer, and there's two files you should have downloaded. Moto Chop or whatever it's called, and the drivers. So for the drivers, I'll have both links down below. The drivers, you're going to install them, and you'll click on the drivers, and then you go through the install method, which is really easy. Just click install, and it'll do it for you. After that, you don't really need that, so you can just put that aside. So here we have Moto Chop, Chopper, okay? So you're going to click on this left hand or right hand click it and you're going to click extract files and you're going to want to extract it to your local disk C okay so um we're going to click right here local disk C and we're going to click okay so as you can see it now extracted now we're going to go over to our local disk C and it should be somewhere here so Moto Chopper right here, okay? So um right now I'm showing you how to install it on Windows, okay? If you're on Windows, you're gonna use this one right here. And if you're on um if you're on Mac or Linux, you're gonna use this one. And you don't need the drivers. So that I don't have Mac or Linux, so I won't be showing you how to install it on that way. This is for Windows, okay guys? So let me zoom in for you to show you what we're clicking on here. And we're going to be clicking on... Oops. Okay, let me zoom out. Otherwise, you can have problems. So we're going to be clicking on Run right here, okay? So we're going to go over here and click Run. And it's going to open up this, okay? So the only thing you need to do... Let me move this over here. Is you're going to click Enter, okay? and it should do everything for you as long as it says daemon started successfully you're gonna leave your phone here until it shows up again so okay so on your phone you should have gotten a pop-up that said allow USB debugging you're gonna click yes and um, vertify app yes and then it'll do this for you now it says press any key to re um, continue you're gonna press enter and it should reboot your phone so um... it's rebooting the phone right now and uh... i'll be back when it has rebooted okay guys so the device just rebooted we're gonna unlock the screen and we should now have super user installed so go to the last page and there it is super user we're gonna open it up and so let's go install an app from the Play Store that uh, requires root. So we're going to use Titanium Backup. Accept it. Let it install, and it should ask for root permission. I'm going to click Open. And uh, there you go. Remember choice forever. Hit allow. And it worked, guys. So um, 
Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe for more videos like this. As I will have um, some ROM reviews coming up for you guys when recovery is released for this 4 And yeah guys, make sure to also donate down below so um, I could get future devices to review. And if you guys enjoyed this video. So um, yeah guys, thanks for watching.